Local school districts in northern New York gathered in Peru today for an art project embracing different art forms. NBC 5's Benny Nezai explains how their art is also helping a local nonprofit. Peru's senior Olivia Bruno is the president of her school's National Art Honor Society. She's very happy to see students from other school districts coming together to create artwork. We're kind of out here helping the younger grades from the different schools uh, kind of understand the different processes of art, uh, understand like why it's so important to be able to express yourself. Students from Peru, Beekmantown, Austable Valley and Saranac Lake worked together Tuesday to create Raku and other art projects. Raku first started in Japan. This process involves putting pottery in an over 1800 degree chamber for 30 minutes to help glaze the texture of the clay. Next, you put the pottery in a bucket of fire for 10 minutes. When that's all set, new color is created on the pottery. One art teacher is impressed to see the diversity in artwork. What's been really nice is seeing the variety of projects that the kids are making. Um, uh, Sable Valley brought these really awesome pumpkins. I'm hoping they're going to turn out great. Some of the artwork will be donated to Elmore SPCA. One student from All Sable Valley is glad to see this project go towards an important cause. Yeah, I think it's kind of nice how we make cats and how they get donated to Elmore SPCA, helping out animals that need homes. But students like Bruno appreciate seeing students from our region gather for one common interest. You look at all these different people here today and you don't know their backgrounds, but yet one thing brought us all together today and that just happened to be art. All the school districts involved are already looking to collaborate again for future projects. In Peru, Benny Nezai, NBC5 News.